What's going on everybody? Corey with Corey's Computer Repair here, back with another repair fix video. And today we have a Dell Alienware Area 51M R2 gaming laptop. The issue with this laptop is the brightness slash dimming is not working. So I could press FN plus F10 or FN plus F9, which is, should be the lowering the brightness or hiring the brightness and you can see the bar pops up but it actually doesn't move and nothing happens with the screen. I've also seen this to where you press the FN and the F9 or F10 and the bar moves but there's actually nothing happening on the screen. So I'm going to show you what I found as the fix and I went through many attempted fixes that were posted on Reddit and I could not figure out what was causing this until I happened to just kind of think outside the box and try a fix and it worked. So let me show you what fixed it. So currently the Dell Alienware laptop is running the latest driver approved from Dell on their website. That is right here, version 31.0.15.2754. So if we come over here to Dell's website, that's this driver right here released on February 20th, 2023. Now it has this long name here, but for those familiar with NVIDIA driver version numbers, I'm gonna tell you it translates to driver version 527.54. That is what it would be if NVIDIA released it. Dell makes it all long like this. So once again, NVIDIA's driver version, when you extract this file and run it, it is version 527.54. Now what I found is, this is the latest and greatest from Dell, and it is the cause of the issue. What I ended up doing was coming over here outside of Dell. Now, I just wanna warn everybody, this can be risky. I usually don't recommend going outside of Dell because Dell approves the drivers as, yes, we tested them, they're 100% tested, they work for this specific system, they're not gonna cause any driver issues or blue screens. So, but for the sake of this issue and the frustration of the customer, I was gonna take a chance and hopefully the driver worked fine and it did. So what I did was come over here on NVIDIA's website and I went to NVIDIA driver downloads. I selected the GeForce, the RTX 20 series because there is a 2070 Super in this laptop. The product, I selected RTX 2070 Super He's running Windows 11. The driver works for Windows 10 and Windows 11, so it really doesn't matter which one you pick. It'll come up to the same driver. Uh, and then I click search. And then it came back with this. GeForce Game Ready Driver version 531.18. Well, look at that. Remember what I said. The latest Dell driver released in February 2023 is version 527.54. NVIDIA's latest is 531.18. So I thought, eh, okay. I'll go ahead and download this, which I already did right here. And I'm going to go ahead and run it. I'm going to click yes. Okay. This is a standard install. The drivers are just simply going to extract. Okay, here we are at the install screen. Uh, I know the customer already has the GeForce experience on here. That keeps the drivers up to date. Uh, so I'm just gonna say, I only want the NVIDIA graphics driver. I'm gonna click agree and continue. Now this is very important. You wanna pay attention to this screen right here. Instead of express install, go ahead and click custom and click next. And then on this screen, on the custom installation options, you know that NVIDIA GeForce Experience is the only thing unchecked, but you wanna go ahead and click this little button here, this little checkbox, perform a clean installation. So this is gonna restore everything to default settings, but it's also gonna go through and completely uninstall the Dell NVIDIA driver version. Completely clean it out 100%. So clean installation is always recommended. Um, so I guess in some cases it's not recommended, but for the most part, I think a clean installation is preferred. So I'm gonna go ahead and have this check marked and I'm gonna click next. 
And now it's going to go through the motions of the install. And for the purpose of this video, I'm going to go ahead and just speed this up. And there we go. The driver has been installed. Go ahead and we're going to click close. Now, don't be discouraged if right after the driver installs, you're going to hit FN and you're going to hit F9 or F10 and you're like, it's not working. What it's not telling you is a reboot is required. So I'm going to go ahead and uh, reboot the system. Okay, we're back up after the reboot, after we installed the latest NVIDIA driver. Let's go ahead and press FN and we're going to press F9 to dim the screen. Look at that. It's all the way dim. Let's press FN plus F10. Working. And that's it. That was the fix. You cannot use the driver from Dell. It just has some kind of bug or glitch they haven't fixed yet. So to recap and sum it up, the latest Dell driver at the time of recording this video is version 52754. Uh, and it does not work. That was the driver released in February 2023 on the Dell website for this Alienware Area 51 MR2 laptop. The driver that works is directly from NVIDIA's website. And at the time of recording this video, the latest driver is version 531.18. And that fixes the dimming issue that a lot of people have on this laptop. So I hope this helps somebody out there. Once again, this is Corey for Corey's Computer Repair. Have a great day.